58. Now to a neighborhood crime alert. Early this morning, a Mobile woman says she woke up to a stranger in her bedroom. She says the man took off after she screamed. As Local 15's Andrew Ramey reports, neighbors are taking action. This is the house he was seen at last. Gerald Partey is on the hunt. He's not a patrol officer, but tonight he's acting as one. Been down this road about 250 times. Party even took off from work to look for the man who police say broke into this house just before 4 in the morning, stole cash out of the woman's purse, and then walked into her bedroom. Party doesn't think of himself as a vigilante, but says he wants to catch the suspect. Without doing bodily harm, try to detain him. But if the burglar is on his property... Yeah, then it's a whole nother ball game. We won't go there. Party lives across the street and says the victim just as easily could have been his wife. I'm treating it kind of like it was my wife, you know, I mean, because she's a single mom and she didn't deserve this. She's very shaken up. She has two little children that, thank goodness, were not home with her at the time. Just 13 hours after the crime already, a moving truck is in the front yard. The victim says she's too terrified to stay another night. You wake up and somebody's pulling covers off of you as I, I couldn't imagine. I couldn't imagine. The victim says she knows who broke into her home, but police have not confirmed the suspect's name to local 15 News. Party says the man has broken into other homes in the neighborhood, but has never been prosecuted. He says it's time for justice. What's right is right and what's wrong is wrong. Andrea Ramey, local 15 News. Well, we are not naming the potential suspect tonight because a spokesperson for the Mobile Police Department could not confirm the name we were given this afternoon. But the victim says she positively identified him in a photo lineup earlier today. Leaders from Mobile.